the misfortunes that plagued one of wrestling's most legendary families would appear to be straight out of a Hollywood script to those unfamiliar with the Von Erichs. Throughout the ages, whispers and tales have given rise to what is now famously referred to as the Von Erich Curse. This curse can be traced back to the character played by the family's patriarch, Jack Atkinson, also known as Fritz Von Erich, during his rise to stardom in the wrestling industry. In a bold move to make a name for himself as a villain, Fritz chose to portray a Nazi, a decision that, according to the superstitious lore, came with a heavy price tag. Jack Atkinson a former football player turned wrestler made a strategic decision to embrace a controversial character in order to captivate audiences and generate intense reactions. Seeking to maximize his impact, he adopted the persona of a Nazi, a choice that was driven by his desire to elicit strong emotions from the crowds. Stu Hart, recognizing Atkinson's imposing stature and what were perceived as stereotypical German features, took notice of him, as reported by Oxygen in an article delving into the family's curse. Interestingly, despite his portrayal, Fritz von Erich had no actual ties or background in Germany. As time went on and the von Erich sons emerged onto the wrestling scene, they gradually shed the Nazi-inspired aspect of their gimmick, opting for a more family-friendly and universally appealing image. This transformation propelled them to become widely recognized and beloved figures in households across the nation. Although the Nazi persona eventually faded away, it left behind a legacy of myths and speculations surrounding the future fate of the Von Erich sons. In his captivating book, The Squared Circle, Life, Death, and Professional Wrestling, author David Shoemaker delved into the haunting curse that plagued the renowned wrestler, Fritz Von Erich. Shoemaker recounted the widely circulated tale of a ghostly Holocaust survivor who sought revenge on Von Erich for his insensitive portrayal of Nazism. The ghost, as Shoemaker revealed, had tragically lost all seven of their sons in the harrowing death camps of World War II Germany. With a heavy heart, the spirit expressed a sincere hope that nothing of that magnitude would befall Fritz. Little did anyone know that those foreboding words would later take on a chilling significance, as the man who embodied a Nazi persona would endure the unbearable pain of burying five of his own sons before his own demise. However, the curse's malevolence did not stop there. The first tragedy struck Fitz von Erich when his six-year-old son, Jack Jr., met a tragic end on a snowy day in 1959. In a heart-wrenching accident, the young boy was electrocuted and drowned in a puddle in the depths of Niagara Falls, Canada. As Vice TV's Dark Side of the Ring explored the von Erich family's tumultuous history, Kevin von Erich, Fritz's son, revealed the devastating aftermath of Jack Jr.'s passing. He shared that his father would often succumb to fits of violent rage overwhelmed by grief and anguish. The curse's grip on Fritz von Erich and his family were undeniably profound, leaving a trail of sorrow and despair in its wake. The haunting tale of the ghostly Holocaust survivor and the tragic losses suffered by the von Erichs served as a chilling reminder of the interconnectedness between life, death, and the enigmatic forces that shape our destinies. David von Erich's untimely demise at the age of 25 sent shockwaves through the wrestling world. While rumors circulated that he had succumbed to an overdose, the truth behind his tragic passing was far more harrowing. David fell victim to a devastating medical condition known as acute enteritis, which caused his intestines to rupture, flooding his body with blood and ultimately leading to a fatal heart attack. In a cruel twist of fate, the Von Erich family would endure further heartbreak in the years that followed. Just three years later, in 1987, Mike Von Erich tragically lost his life due to an overdose of tranquilizers near his childhood home. The pain continued to mount as Chris Von Erich, who had been wrestling alongside his brothers, succumbed to his own inner demons and took his own life in 1991. The weight of these tragedies was almost unbearable for the Von Erich family. Kevin Von Erich, left to grapple with unimaginable grief, made a devastating discovery outside of his family's farm. His own brother, Chris, had tragically ended his life with a gunshot wound to the head. In 1992, tragedy struck the Von Erich family once again when Kerry Von Erich, the most accomplished brother of the clan, tragically took his own life at the age of 33. This devastating event came shortly after a motorcycle accident that resulted in the amputation of his right foot. Sadly, Kerry had been battling addiction to painkillers leading up to his untimely demise, which occurred just days after his birthday. The Von Erich family had already endured unimaginable heartache 
having laid five of their sons to rest. However, the weight of grief took a toll on their patriarch, Fritz von Erich, who succumbed to both brain and lung cancer at the age of 68. Over the years, Fritz's health deteriorated rapidly, exacerbated by the loss of his sons and the dissolution of his 40-year marriage to his wife, Doris. The alleged curse that plagued the von Erich family appears to have been dispelled upon Fritz von Erich's passing, offering solace to those who embrace the supernatural. Residing in the serene paradise of Hawaii, Kevin von Erich, the sole surviving son, has found refuge alongside his loved ones. Despite the contentious origins surrounding their patriarch, the von Erich family was bestowed with a prestigious honor in 2009, induction into the esteemed WWE Hall of Fame. Graciously accepting this recognition, Kevin stood proudly among his kin, symbolizing the enduring legacy that they have forged within the realm of professional wrestling. Yet, the family connection to the wrestling world extends far beyond this momentous occasion. Lacey Von Erich, Carrie's daughter, defied the supposed curse and carved her own path to triumph in TNA, showcasing her remarkable talent and resilience. Furthermore, Kevin's sons, Ross and Marshall, had dutifully followed in their family's footsteps, gracing the rings of Major League Wrestling with their undeniable prowess. Through their unwavering dedication and unwavering spirit, the Von Erich family has transcended the boundaries of mere superstition, leaving an indelible mark on the world of professional wrestling. Thank you for making it all the way through the video. If you like this video, hit that like and subscribe button, and give me your thoughts in the comments down below. And as always, until next time.